Father, we thank you for this beautiful day, a day in which you are fulfilling the desires of Charles and Kayla's hearts to be joined together in marriage. We pray that your blessing will always rest upon them, and that joy, peace, and contentment would dwell within them as they live together in unity, and that all who enter their home may experience the strength of your love. Father, help them to follow and serve you with an ever-growing commitment. Guide them into greater love and sacrifice as they care for each other's needs, knowing you will care for theirs. And may they always be as aware of your presence in their marriage as we sense it here today at their wedding. And may their devotion in marriage be a radiant reflection of your love for us, for the entire world to see. In the name of Jesus we pray, amen. I was always taught to ask God for what you want and to be specific. I always ask for a wife and a best friend that would support me and love me. With you, I got so much more. Someone that I could love effort effortlessly. Someone that I could look, that I would look and forward to seeing every day. I got a best friend. I promise to keep God first in our marriage and you second in that order. I pledge to hold these promises forever and always. Caleb Brooke, I love you. From the first time that we met, I knew there was something special about us. It's one of those feelings that is hard to explain. All I know is you became my person and it felt right. So thank you for embracing all the parts that make me me. I promise to try to make you feel as special as you are to me. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to always pursue you. I promise to be your best friend for as long as we both shall live. Loving you is the best thing that ever happened to me and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you, Charles McLeaf. And now by the virtue and authority invested in me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I pronounce you husband and wife. Charles, you may kiss your bride, my brother. See you.